40 miles away in L.A., another policeman, retired Captain Randy Kwan, can't get through to his 28-year-old daughter, Monica. It was typical of the family to talk every night. They became concerned. They saw a breaking news story that we were investigating a murder in Irvine. He saw the uh, community that was being pictured and recognized it. In fact, Monica's building is the one pictured in the news. Now, panic is really setting in. He then called the Irvine Police Department and told our dispatchers that he believed that Monica may be the victim of the homicide that we were investigating. And based on his description, investigators think he's right. Incredibly tough for, for a father. Still in a state of shock, Randy and his wife get to the station as fast as they can. A lot of us investigating the case had kids, and you feel that emotional connection, you feel that personal connection, and uh, you feel for Randy Kwan and, and what he must be going through. Kwan says that Monica and Brie have trouble on the job. We spoke with Randy Kwan, and he couldn't think of anything in his past career working for the Los Angeles Police Department that would contribute to this. Each of these investig... There's that, that, that kind of heartbreak that you have when, when a family member, one of your police brothers or sisters, loses a family member. It hurts all of us. This poor guy's uh, daughter was brutally killed along with her fiancé for apparently no reason. No robbery done with... Pop uh, Pulte there, he got in a fight once or twice with some people in the academy. He said that his training officer, Terry Evans, had kicked an individual. Dorner's false accusations against Evans landed him in a hearing before the LAPD's Board of Rights, where he failed to make his case and ended up fired. Sergeant Evans then remembers something terrifying. Christopher Dorner's representative, who failed to get him acquitted, is someone she knows someone connected to the victim. She started thinking his representative at the Board of Rights was Randy Kwan. Father of murder victim Monica Kwan. The double homicide. The equipment found in the dumpster. The LAPD. She's connected at all. She said, you know what, I gotta call and tell him, hey, you should look at this guy. 